And, and speaking of that gun suppression unit that, you've, you've, that you talked about, yes, how many illegal guns have you confiscated and how is this reducing crime in the county? 60 seconds. We certainly have uh, confiscated numerous guns. Not only have we confiscated new guns out in the city with those checkpoints, we've also confiscated numerous weapons out of our detention center, which is very important because a lot of the crimes that are happening in the city that we're placing these folks in harm's way when we put them in the uh, detention center, we make sure that we are committed to taking guns not only out of our community, but out of our jail system. It has wreaked havoc on our, uh, not only on the community at large, it has wreaked havoc specifically in the city of Jackson. So we have uh, certainly, uh, and we're going to be more robust and more aggressive with these uh, checkpoints. And that is what we're doing right now. And uh, we have the uh, commitment of other agencies outside of Jackson to make sure not only we are creating a safe environment inside of Hines County, but on the borders of Hines County. I think those relationships and partnerships with our uh, 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 Tri-County area, I think is gonna certainly produce uh, good results in reducing crime in the metropolitan area, specifically in Jackson, but we certainly don't want to 